listening to Ben Hunt, he believes that we would go from current deflationary period to an inflationary or stagflationary period as early as next year. Is goal to hedge against both? What happens to equities and in particular um, high PE, I guess high multiple stocks with stagflation? Yep. So uh, let's go to the quad map, guys. Pop it up there on slide six. And again, it's not just Ben who thought that. Like, if you notice, we talked about that through the lens of my quads, and he did use my, my, my language, which was awesome. I love the discussion. I love it when you can collaborate with somebody who knows what they're actually talking about, which was fantastic. Uh, that, that guy is good. All right. Now, what uh, Ben and I were talking about, like, when you think about the model. Now, if you want to really blow the mind of not only, like, your kids, you can teach your kids this. Uh, my son's pretty good at it. Actually, he's not quite at the calculus level yet, he's 12 years old, but I'm betting that Jack McCullough is going to be able to beat, by the time he's 13, 14 years old, beat most 40 to 50 year old old wall guys. Because uh, he can read this, okay? So again, this is, you've got to be able to read this, okay? So all you got to do is teach yourself. So when you, when you look at uh, deep quad four, so this is quad four obviously in here, this is bad. Now when you go down all the way over there, the migrate, you, you can only go, it's like putting Jack McCullough in the corner, and he's been in the corner many times. Okay, now the corner, when you come out of the corner, you, f you go free. You feel, you feel shame in the corner, then you come out. So this is what we're talking about. You start to go into deep quad three, that's most likely, these, these dots are going to drop down here. You're going to be deep quad three, and then you're going to resuscitate from there. So the path that Ben and I were talking about was quite literally that. Now that, obviously from an economic perspective, is bad for multiples. That was a really important question. Because during, because this down in here, you either have deflation or you have stagflation. Stagflation is the worst economic setup for multiples on both credit and equity. You go back to the 1970s, even Warren Buffett himself was completely confounded by this. I, this was part of my senior thesis at Yale. He couldn't believe that you could buy a stock for three, four, or five times earnings. That's what happened to multiples when you have 1970s style economic stagflation. So that's the big risk, Jonesy. I think that that, and by the way, that question should be voted up. And whoever voted it down is just being an asshole, because that is a damn good question. Thank you, Ron from Florida.